what's up? This is Boston on Earth, and you're watching Rock and Metal News. Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News with a Rock and Metal News update. Megadeth and Megadeth.com's annual Christmas card, best Christmas card contest, had a twist this year. Uh, people submit uh, Christmas cards to Megadeth and they choose the best one. And the winner gets a phone call on Christmas Day from Dave Mustaine. Well, this year it looks like... Uh, and one of the winner had submitted their possible plagiarism um, as he had, uh, possibly submitted someone else's artwork and just modified it a bit. So they are investigating, and if that is the case, they're going to phone the second place person. Dave's going to give them a call uh, and uh, work it all out. And Megadeth is still investigating. And Steve Morris from Deep Purple, Richie Kotzen from Mr. Big and Poison, Uli John Roth from The Scorpions, and Gus G from Firewind and Ozzy will perform at a special concert on Wednesday, January the 23rd at Slim's in San Francisco, California to make a statement that Jason Becker's Not Dead Yet. Jason Becker's Not Dead Yet Festival proceeds will go towards medical supplies for Jason and a trust fund for his future security. Jason Becker uh, was a guitar prodigy and also a part of cacophony uh, and he was diagnosed with ALS which is Lou Gehrig's disease at 20 after joining uh, David Lee Ross band for the album A Little Ain't Enough so uh, it should be a good concert and it's for a good cause and Visions of Atlantis have recently released an update. The year 2012 slowly draws to a close and we are very happy that our upcoming album Athera is finally also very close to being finished. Almost one year of writing and another year of recording, improving, re-recording and more will soon turn into the most ambitious album to date. So keep an eye on our Facebook page as the release dates, artwork, brand new band pictures and more are on the way. The next three months promise a lot to be uh, found here at first hand. So Vision of Atlantis new CD, Athera is set for an early 2013 release through Napalm Records. And Psycho Spoon, the band formed by Pete, ex-drummer of Nile, has hired on Nile's Carl Sanders to produce the band's debut album titled Incognito. The recording will begin in January with a release date April 2013. And the band Him played a new song titled I Will Be The End Of You at their show on December 26th in Finland. Video footage of the show is on YouTube thanks to Nail. And uh, you can check out the link in the description of this video. And Him have finished their new full length Tears on Tape. Stay tuned for release date on that. And Patrick Samato, drummer for former New York band Locked in a Vacancy, was killed on an, in an automobile accident early Wednesday morning. Police stated uh, that uh, Rick was involved in a head-on collision after the driver of another vehicle left his lane and hit Rick head-on. Both drivers were killed and two passengers were injured. Rick was 37 years old. The band issued the following statement. Today we mourn the loss and celebrate the life of Rick, the the time we all spent with him will always be treasured and held close to each other in our hearts. May he look down and smile at the outpouring of love. May the music we make let us live forever. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News. Thanks for tuning in.